Uh, this question is reverse words in the string. So we are giving a string S. So reverse the order of the words, right? So uh, this is pretty much it, right? So uh, so let's just look at the example. So uh, the string S is what? The sky is blue, right? So you basically reverse the order. Uh, you know, basically you swap, right? So uh, the will be at the end, sky will be the second last. And the blue, blue will be the first one, and is will be the second, and then blue is sky low, right? And then if you have the uh, leading zero, and then the ending, I mean, sorry, leading space and the ending space, right? You want to what? You want to trim, right? So, uh, and then you have to reverse the word later. So, uh, uh, if you have a space in the between, you, you only need one, right? So you don't need multiple. So you're still going to reverse the word, right? And then, but if you have multiple space, you know, basically you just get rid of it, right? And you only need to insert one. So let's talk about the solution. So in this question, we have two solutions. So the first solution is going to use in the what? The uh, string split. So I'm going to split the word based on the space, right? So you have what? The string array. You have what? You have s dot split. And then later on, you will just basically um, create a string builder and insert the string, insert every single word at index zero. So you want to insert the string at index at index zero. So okay, so string uh, string builder will be empty first, right? And then you insert the so you insert the I mean the world uh, at index zero. So in the beginning, it will be like this, and then later on you have a space, right? So you uh, you do what? You insert a space at index zero. So it's gonna be what? The I mean sorry the space space and the right. So this is the old one. Now you are going to traverse the next one, right? So it's sky, right? So you are what? Insert the string at index zero. So it's gonna be what? Sky. The right. And then this is not done yet because what you need a space, right? So space. Put a space in the first one, right? And then do the exactly the same thing, and it's going to be is blue, right? But the last one will be what? You have a blue, and then sorry, space blue. Space is space sky space the right. So you want to delete the first one, then you can use trim. So you trim it, right? So you'll return this one. So this is the first solution. So let's just start coding and then you will be super straightforward. So string builder, sorry, string array, strings, s dot split based on the space. You have the string builder, sp equal the new string builder. And then you, I will have to traverse string, string, with the strings, right? So uh, if the uh, string dot length is actually equal to zero, then I don't have to take care of it, right? So I continue. And then if the s dot, uh, if there's a string which is, uh, which has something, so it, uh, let's just talk about the right? You want to insert the index with a string, right? But it has to be what? Uh, Char array, right? So you have to say to char array. And then later on, you want to what? <coughs> Add a space in the between, right? So this is the pretty much the solution. Uh, Alright. I think this is the, you know, the system error. So later on, you want to return to string, uh, what? Trim. So this will be pretty much a solution. So let me run it. Oh. Uh, instead of you. Uh, instead of using the append, just using the insert. So it's still going to be insert in this deal. This is my typo, sorry. All right. So let's just look at this. Uh, look at this, look at this. So I'm, I'm running the debug mode. And yes. So it pause at any second. So I made a mistake. I have to insert, not using a pen. So, yeah. The space, right? Sky, sky, the, and then space, right? 
Actually, there's a space in between, right? I mean, at first. Then blue, blue. Then you trim, right? So look at this. The trim builder has a space at index, at index zero. Then you trim. Then you will get rid of the space. So this is the first solution. So the second solution is pretty simple. I'm going to use the deck queue. So again, so I have a deck queue, right? So I, I'm adding the word, I'm adding the word into the, you know, stack, right? So the sky is blue. So it's pretty much like this, right? And then uh, the only thing I have to deal with is what? The leading zero and then ending, I'm uh, sorry, leading space and ending space. All right. So um, I have two pointer. So uh, when I traverse uh, to a spot which is not the space anymore, I will I will I will have to know my starting what well, my starting string will be here, right? And then again, I will decrement the J pointer, which is you know checking the ending space. When I stop, I will know this is not uh, uh, this is the ending string uh, array right? i mean sorry uh string word right so i will have to traverse from here to here and then this is pretty much it so uh let's just stop coding and you'll be able to understand what happened so i have in i equal to zero <coughs> j will be equal to a star length minus one right so I'll, when i less than a star length and also a star char at a i is equal to the space i need to increment the uh, the index and also exactly the same thing, but in this one, I'm decrement. So greater or equal to zero, and a star chart at j is equal to the space I decrement, right? So now I know like my uh, starting position and ending position is what uh, is noted, right? Then I was using the string builder to what? New string builder to keep my string valid because I right now I'm using this uh you I'm using a two pointer so I will keep the I will keep the word so I will keep the word inside the string builder so I need a deck queue put in the string new array deck and then while I less than equal to j right and then my current char is going to be what is the char char at ai well if the sb dot two string dot length is not dot length is not equal to zero and also c is equal to the space so what does this mean oh i made a typo so what does this mean i already has some character in my string builder and also the current spot is what is a space right so I know I, I already traverse a hollow, right? So hollow inside a string builder, so I push into the uh, deck, right? So it's gonna be what is, uh, sorry, dead, dot, offer first, uh, sp dot two string, right? So once I have it, I need to reset my string builder. So just basically set length equal to zero. And then everything else, uh, you have to fulfill one condition which is C is not equal to space, right? So which means there is a, you know, uh, there's a chart at least, right? And then I will just say SB dot pen SC. And then every single time you increment your I. So again, uh, once, so once you finish the last one, right? Uh, the stream builder is not empty. You have to what? Doing the exactly the same thing. So offer first stream builder dot two string for, for the last word, right? And then later on, later on you are using the deck queue, and then you want to join with the space, right? So for current for current idea, you have a deck, right? So the will be here, and sky. Sorry. Okay, so uh, I offer first, right? So the will be here, right? And then when I offer first again, so you push a sky. At the first position, so low will be here, and then you push your is at first, so you will be like this is sky 
le, right? So in the beginning, I was like, uh, I was actually writing the stuff wrong. I would say the sky is blue, right? I mean, this could also work, but uh, but not in my case, right? Uh, my solution is offer first, and then I, when I when I push every single uh, single string out, I will use the string dot join. So return string dot join with a space, and then what you need is what your array deck. So this is pretty much it, right? Submit. All right, so let's talk about the first solution, which is this one, the time and space. Uh, this is all of them, and represent the end of the S, right? You create a string array, and the string builder is exactly the same thing for every single word. So the worst case is going to be all of them. And in this one, you have two pointer. Uh, you have uh, memory, which is string builder, and then, and then deck string, right? So this is all of them for the space, right? And then the time is all of them, you traverse every single one of them, right? And this one is definitely all of them for the time. So the space and time are all of them, and n represent the end of the string s, right? So this is a solution. So I can run the debug more on this one, but it actually doesn't matter. I mean, uh, let's just look at this. All right. So you push every single char. Uh, you pause at any second you want, and then I'm just keep moving. Right, the last one you didn't, uh, you didn't push into the stack yet. But in, but at the end of the while loop, you push into the stack. Sorry, stack, and then later on you you use the string dot join, and this is pretty much the solution. Alright, so if you have any question, leave a comment below. Subscribe if you want it. Alright, peace out. Bye.